What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to kick off the Gauntlet series for the Bose Quiet Comfort Gen 2 earbuds. Now, I usually try to do uh, a competition like this with other earbuds within their price point or somewhere close to it. And uh, I still am going to do that. I'm going to continue to do that with this. But I just wanted to let you guys know because I know you're going to be asking why am I not using this one or why am I not doing this one? I'm going in uh, based on to 150 uh, at retail, retail price. Not the price that you can probably get them now because I'm sure these ones are probably cheaper. But I'm going to say I'm going to go in between the $100 and $200 range uh, for this one. These guys come in about $179, $180. So I'm going to go from 100 between $100 and 200 bucks. Uh, for this uh, gauntlet series for this one and first up will be the Motorola Moto Buzz Plus So this should be a very interesting head-to-head. -head. I want to see how these Two square off mainly because the Moto Buzz Plus are tuned by Bose. So I want to see uh, How exactly how different these guys are as far as their sound goes All right, let's go ahead and pull one of each of these out real quick as you can see, the Quiet Comfort Gen 2s are the in-ear style, a little chunkier, uh, much chunkier than the uh, Moto Buzz Plus, at, which are the actual stem style. Ugh, I knew I was going to drop it. I went to switch fingers. And <laughs> All right. Both of them, even though their sizes are very, very comfortable, I'm still using their stock large ear tips for both. I haven't switched, uh, I haven't switched out the uh, Moto Buzz for... For a spin fits yet, but I have plans. <laughs> so let's go ahead and uh, put these back in. And what we want to do is we're going to go ahead and go through our comparison testing. Then we'll come back for that sound test. Stay strapped in. This is a mic test with the Bose Quiet Comfort Gen 2 earbuds in a quiet location. This is a mic test with the Bose Quiet Comfort Gen 2 earbuds in a quiet location. This is a mic test with the Bose Quiet Comfort Gen 2 earbuds in a crowded location. This is a mic test with the Bose Quiet Comfort Gen 2 earbuds in a crowded location. This is a mic test with the Motorola Moto Buds Plus earbuds in a quiet location. This is a mic test with the Motorola Moto Buds Plus earbuds in a quiet location. This is a mic test with the Motorola Moto Buds Plus earbuds in a crowded location. This is a mic test with the Motorola Moto Buds Plus earbuds in a crowded location. All right, we out in my backyard for a noise canceling test for the new Bose Quiet Comfort second gen earbuds. Uh, right now we're in, actually we're in transparency mode, so everything is pretty clear. I can hear all the traffic around me. Uh, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and flip these guys into noise canceling mode. As you can hear, we got traffic on the street behind us and the turnpike behind me. So here we go. All right. All right, noise canceling is turned on and it is very, very quiet. Nicely done. I can hear absolutely nothing. Like nothing. Everything, whisper quiet. They're just living up to the boat's name. Again, this is scary. I have to keep looking around because of. <laughs> But these guys are doing a fantastic job. Absolutely no sound whatsoever. I did switch out to the larger ear tips uh, and a large wing on each of these. But again, no music is being played whatsoever. Uh, so this is just the strength of the noise canceling and they are doing a fantastic job. Top notch. Uh, out of So now basically if I have to go one to 10, one being trash, 10 being the absolute best, uh, Let's see. I definitely have to give these guys a 9.5. Nine and a half. Because I know, uh, to be honest, no one's perfect. There's always room for improvement somewhere. So nine and a half it is. Top of the line, in my opinion. So this has been the ANC test for the Bose Quiet Comfort Gen 2s. All right, we are in my backyard. We got the Bud, the Motorola Moto Buzz Plus. In the air, we're gonna do a quick noise canceling test. Let's go ahead and uh, set the picture. Right now, we're in transparency mode. I got my neighbor's dog barking. I got cars on the back side of the house driving. I got cars on the turnpike. Central air units is firing off. 
uh, the lawnmower stop, but we got a good test bed. So right now we're gonna go ahead and do a long press on the right earbud to get into noise canceling. Oh, before we do that, just wanna let you know, I did switch out the ear tips. So I'm using the large so I can get a better seal and no audio is being played during this test. It's strictly the noise canceling technology. So here we go. All right, noise canceling has been turned on. I got the chime and it's doing a really good job. Like I cannot hear the traffic anywhere and I could barely, barely hear my neighbor's uh, central air unit. Um, it is, so these are doing a really, really good job. I can't even hear my dog. I don't know if the dog's barking or not, but I can't hear it. Um, so again, doing a wonderful job on these. Uh, again, no audio is being played. So if I had to choose between one and 10, if I had to rate these, one being absolute worst, 10 being the best, uh, I would definitely give these a solid, uh, yeah, seven and a half. I would definitely be, I'll be happy with that. Uh, they're doing a really good job. Like I said, I could barely hear the uh, Citra unit. I am getting, now I am getting a little more of a, like cricket. I think I can, I can hear that a little bit. So yeah, seven and a half is a really good spot for these. These are really uh, doing a really good job. All right, so this has been the ANC test for the Moto Buds Plus by Motorola. All right, we are back in for the sound test. I did a coin flip off camera and we are gonna start off with the uh, Bose Quad Comfort Gen 2s. All right, let's go ahead and put these guys in. Get them locked in. All right. All right, so now we're in. We'll go ahead and show you. Right now we are in. Actually, make sure we're in. We're in a wear mode. Right now, as you can see here. Okay, let's go ahead. We'll jump over to the equalizer. And this is my EQ settings. For the quad, the QC Gen 2, so I'm just gonna call them that. All right, we're gonna make sure we had our optimal listening level. All right, I think, yeah, I think we're good right there. All right, so what we're gonna do now is we'll go ahead and flip over to our first song. Let's get it. Okay, nice volume. Actually, I can knock these down one. There we go. Nice sound stage, nice and wide. You know, they got a nice little space between them. The vocals are very crisp and cl very clear. Very nice. Very was loving the de the, clar the clarity. I'm loving it. Oh, just the brightness of the sound is really good. Oh, very, and then when the background vocalists come in, uh, sounds so good. And again, that's that spatial that sp that uh, sound stage is nice. And why I lost my words there. Very clean. And then, of course, when they get in, there all three of them are singing. It sounds nice and full. But they still, you still can feel the space, hear the space between them as well. So that's really good job done there uh, on the first song by the Bose uh, QC Gen 2s. All right, so if you have these songs, feel free to come on and join me and listen in, and you can hear what I'm hearing. And if you're not, leave it in the comments. Or if you, you know, if you're not hearing one of them, or you're hearing something different, please leave it in the comments section. I like to chop it up with y'all. All right, let's go ahead and. Flip these over to the Moto Buzz Plus. See how they do. All right, we're back in with the uh, Moto <clears throat> Buzz Plus, and I forgot to mention that I did switch them, the uh, both uh, QC Gen Twos into noise canceling mode. I just used the touch controls on the uh, on the earbud to do it. I forgot to mention that, but I want to let y'all know that yes, I was listening to them in noise canceling. Um, I just want to keep it one hundred with you guys. All right, so. Right now we are in the app for the Moto Buzz Plus. As you can see, we are in the transparency mode. Let's go ahead into sound here. 
And we got, let me see, the equalizer. There's my EQ settings. I do have high res turned on. Um, but, you know, I just, I don't know. I, I <laughs> They say they have high res audio. They sound really good, so I'll have that on. Um, I'm going to leave that on there. Actually, you know what? Let's turn that off. No, cancel that. I ain't going to go through all that. All right. So let's go ahead. I know I'm going to hear, well, you don't have high res with the QCO, you know, the, I know I'm going to hear it, but hey, I got everything else turned on for them guys as well. So let's go ahead and flip these over to noise canceling. All right. So noise canceling is turned on. Make sure we are optimal listening level. All right. We're there. And here we go. All right. Good sound. Nice, clear vocals. I like very nice. Nice sound stage. Why it gives nice. It gives you definitely some space in between the vocalists. You can hear that. Very clear. Very nice. I like the way you sound. Again, you got that detail with the lead vocalist in their voice, in her voice. The breaths, you're getting all of that. Very nice. I like the clarity. I like the clarity. I like the sound stage. I love the detail. These guys came to play. All right, let's go ahead and get to our bass song. All right, we are back in for the bass song. We got the QC Gen 2s in the air. Let's go. Ooh, already punching me. Oh, nice. Nice bass. Here goes the bass drop. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yes, rattle the eardrums. Oh, that reverb right there. And again, the shimmering sound. Nice balance, not overpowering the bass. Oh, that reverb is just... Oh, sounds so good. Uh, I love, and it's clean, too. It's not distorted sounding or anything. Very nice. Here's that bass drop again. Oh, <laughs> that reverb. Very nice. Oh. Oh, man. I could. Oh, this sounds so clean, so powerful. That re, the bass drop, the reverberation. Oh, it's just rattling the eardrums all over. Oh, it sounds so good. I love it. And again, like I said, the shimmering sound was nice and clear, but balanced. It wasn't overpowering the bass. Uh, by the highs and the mids and highs being uh, tuned where they're too high. Uh, and it's like dude, I find in some uh, headphones and earbuds, but they sound really, really good. All right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and get this flipped over to the Moto Buzz Plus, see how they do. All right, we are back in. We got the Moto Buzz Plus in. We got the bass song queued up. Let's go. Okay. Nice punchy bass, clean sounding. Ooh, rattling the air canals. Here goes that bass drop. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that reverb right there, that four seconds, nice. And the shimmering sound, again, balance, not overpowering the bass at all. Oh, that reverb is sick. Oh, so clean. Mm, 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 mm. This sounds really good. Oh. <laughs> yes, here comes the bass drop again. I love the balance. I love the, the, the how clean this bass is. And it's just rattling my eardrums all over the place.
Oh, okay. Oh man, this is this is this is going this is going to be something. This is going to be something to think about because man, they are definitely uh, they definitely come to play today. All right, great bass, great balance. Reverb was sick on this one. Let's go ahead and get to our final song. All right, we are back in final song. QC Gen 2's in. Let's go. Nice, clear vocal or instruments, the keyboard. And the low, the low keys gets nice and low for it. I like that. Nice, crisp lead saxophone. Sounds very clear. Very nice. The clarity is fantastic. Um, and the balance is there. The, the balance is nice. And the echoing, man, the detail is top notch. Very clear. Oh, sounds so good. Don't do the, that, that combination and just the way it sounds together. And us, uh, I love the sound of the, I love what I got out of it. And the sound stage was nice and wide. So it was, didn't sound like they were right on top of each other. Um, had a nice little bit of spacing between them, but they sound that they, the both, uh, really have them. Uh, repro reproduce that song really nicely. All right, so let's go ahead and get these flipped over to the Moto Buzz Plus. See how they do. All right, we're back in. We got the uh, Moto Buzz Plus in the air. Final song. Let's go. Very clear. Very clean. Oh, like that low. The low keys. Nice little rumble there. Uh, Lee saxophone, nice and crisp. Again, sound balance is there. Sound stage is nice, nice and wide. Nice, just you feel the you can feel the space in me. They're not sound like they're on top of each other. At least to me, it doesn't sound that way. Very clear. Oh, it sounds so good. Very nice. Again, them low keys, you're getting that nice low end sound out of them too. So that detail is definitely there. Oh, okay. Sounds so nice and uh, so clear. <laughs> I love it. Man, this is going to be a tough one. All right, let's go ahead, get this cleaned up. We'll come back. We're going to talk about these two. We're going to pick our winner. Stay strapped in. All right, back in Gauntlet Series, episode number one for the Bose Quad Comfort Gen 2s. And their first opponent is the Motorola Motobuzz Plus. And this has been quite the battle for both of these guys. I mean, they both sound great. Um, both of them gave me nice, clear vocals, especially in the low song. Nice sound separation, nice space uh, soundstage. They're definitely separate. You could tell that, you know, there's some space between the vocalists, but when they sing together, it sounds nice and full. And I'm giving them both credit on that. Um, I know I'm going backwards because I usually do the app and everything else, but uh, I just, I wanted to talk about the music first because these guys are so, so, so close together when it comes to their sound. Um, as far as bass, again, it's completely... They are just great. I mean, they both gave me the reverb, rocking the ear canals, just complete, uh, just great, just great. All right, uh, and again, got the balance with the, with the shimmering sound, the high, the mids and highs were balanced. It didn't overpower the bass, but they still can maintain their clarity. Both of them did a great job there. And then on our last song, again, they both really, really shine for me. Uh, got the high keys. And then the, the low end, the low keys got that nice low end bump uh, on them for both of them. And then, of course, the lead saxophone was just 
nice and crisp. And you had, again, once again, you had that nice sound stage where they didn't sound like the mute. They were right on top of each other and spaced out nicely, but balanced. Both of them did that. Fantastic job there. All right, now let's go ahead. And I know, like I said, I'm doing this backwards. So we're going to go ahead, jump to the front of the jump to the front. We're going to talk about everything else. And then we're going to make our choice here. All right. So as far as the app goes, um, I'm going to give that win to the new uh, QCE app for Bose. Um, I think that one has a lot more features and a lot more things to offer. Um, I do like the uh, Motorola app. I do like what it gives, but I'm, I, I'm just, I have to give that point to the QCE app. And then, of course, uh, moving on, you've got your mics. Uh, I'm a, I'm, uh, I'm gonna give them both the I'm gonna give them both a point on that. And then one is not better than the other, at least to my ear uh, and to when I've, I've talked to people uh, with those earbuds in, um, they they stay. I haven't had any problems, so uh, I'm gonna give them both a point there. All right, as far as noise canceling. Uh, this is tough because they both have really great noise canceling, but I think I'm going to give that edge slightly to the QC Gen 2s, just slightly. I think I'm going to give it to them just slightly. I think mainly it's because of uh, their form factor, their design and everything. I get a little I get a little more of a tighter seal when it comes to the noise canceling than I do with uh, the stem style here. But not don't knock it. They have a great seal and you they get quiet but they're not on uh, the level, uh, not quite, not quite on the level of the QC uh, Gen 2s here. Now, as far as the sound goes, they're, I'm telling you, these guys are very, very close, but um, I have to give it to the QC Gen 2s because they're a little bit louder. Their sound is just a little bit louder than the Motor Buds Plus, uh, just their natural volumes. It, it's louder. Okay. You got more, you get more detail. You get, uh, you hear more things out of the song when it's a brighter sound. Um, you pick up on things like that. Uh, whereas they you have a nice, decent volume. I mean, you know, you don't have to max them all the way out to get the sounds you want, but they're not, you know, I, between these two, the, the QC, Gen 2s are brighter are a brighter sound. So I, I'm gonna go with this one. They're gonna get the win for sound. So if I had to pick one of these to go with, uh, I would definitely have to go with the QC Gen 2s over the Moto Buzz Plus because of that sound. Um, and you know, because of the sound and the noise canceling being just a little bit better. But man, uh I mean, if you decide to go with the motos, I can't even be mad at you. I really can't because they are a really good pair of earbuds. They really come pack in a while up. But, and it was a good head to head. I figured since both did some tuning to these, it would be good to see how well they did as compared to their own brand of uh, earbud. And they really did a really good job here. I can't, I, I cannot lie. They did a really, they brought out a really good product for Motorola here. So, but they just can't, they just that, uh, far away from the um moto but i mean excuse me the qc gen 2 so my winner of this one is the qc gen 2s if you like what you see go and hit the like button if you want to join me as i continue to do videos like this and others go and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell that way you notify when videos like this and others drop and i'll see you on the next one peace